Hello everyone, Alex here and welcome to today's workout which is a full body 40 minute Tabata workout. Are you ready? Let's get started with a nice warm up. Starting with jog on the spot. Let's start nice and relaxed as we build up our heart rate, our warmth through our body and activate our muscles ready for this intense Tabata workout. Take it into a squat arm circle, reach the arms down, big circles in the shoulders, squat arm circle. Good quality squat, start activating in the legs, stretching the legs, warming them up. Come down into a down the dog position and start walking your heels into a walking dog. And take it into a deep squat stretch to a hamstring stretch. So deep squat, chest up, heels down, then lift up, stretch the hamstrings, move between those two positions in your own time, moving side to side, get some movement in your ankles, knees, hips, whatever feels good for you to stretch through that lower body. Okay, and hands back down onto the ground into a high plank position. Bring your shoulders above your hands, lock out the arms, the legs, put in the belly, strong core, squeeze the glutes, start activating through the whole body before we start this Tabata workout. So, Tabata is 20 seconds work and 10 seconds rest, so it's very fast pace and we have Lots of different sections for the whole body to get through. Okay, turn it onto your back into a back roll and reach toes. So roll up onto your back, straight legs reach forwards to touch your toes. Massage the back on the floor, stretch and reach forwards. Okay, and final exercise, come to a bridge position, put in the belly, lift the hips up, we're gonna take it to a bridge walk. Lift one foot up off the floor, drive the knee, squeeze the other leg, place that leg down and switch. Keep your hips up the whole time. Last few seconds in the warm up before we begin. Start activating the hamstrings, the glutes, the lower back. So the first section of this workout 
is a lower body section. We have 20 seconds work, 10 seconds rest on five exercises for three sets. Rest there, well done. Grab a drink if you need it. I'll switch the timer to 20 seconds work, 10 seconds rest. First exercise in the lower body section is a reverse lunge knee drive, okay? So with one leg, reverse lunge knee drive. Only place this back foot down behind you, okay? Get ready in three, two, one. Here we go. 20 seconds, reverse lunge, knee drive, really building strength in that front leg, glutes, thighs. Let's go. Rest there, 10 seconds. Switch over to the other side. Let's go. Well done, rest there. We're gonna take it to a squat kick. Good quality, standard squat. Kick that front leg and switch the legs. Let's go. So 20 seconds moves quite fast, but we've got lots of exercises and reps to get through. So don't worry, you will be challenged. Well done, rest there. Squat knee drive done or squat kick complete. Let's take it to a squat in and out, okay? Narrow squat with me, squat and then out. Squat in, squat out. Let's go. Keep it going. And rest there, well done. Exercise five out of five. Let's take it to a sumo squat. Wider in the legs, out turn the feet. We're gonna pulse. Come down with me, here, pulse. Don't stand up, stay here. Keep the knees out wide. Up and down a few inches. through the burn and rest. Those five exercises, let's do three sets, okay? Back to the squat, uh, the reverse lunge, knee drive with that first leg. Let's go. You'll find the muscles burn, but we're also getting the heart rate up. Well done, rest there, other leg. Let's go. Drive that knee up, nice and tall in the torso, core engaged. Well done, get ready for the squat kick. Here we go, good squat, front kick. Rest there, get ready for the squat in and out. If it's too challenging, you can squat and step if you like. Here we go. Narrow, wide, narrow, wide.
Well done. Let's take it to the sumo squat. Pulsing up and down. Here we go, down we go and pulse. Getting the groin, adductors, quads, glutes, all over lower body, really working. Stay with me through the burn. Well done, 10 seconds rest, let's do it one more time. Reverse lunge, knee drive. Let's go. Last time in these five exercises. Well done, other leg. Let's go. Rest there, get ready for the squat kick. Here we go, squat, kick. Up to you on how high you kick, depending on your flexibility, but be powerful. Well done, squat kick complete. Squat in and out and then sumo. Let's go, in, out. Well done, rest there. Legs are working. Let's finish in the sumo before the upper body section. Let's go. Pulse it. Don't stand up now. Final part of the leg section. Then we're going straight down into push-ups. And rest there, well done. Down we go, first section complete. Let's take it into an atomic push-up, which is a push-up and a squat thrust. Let's go with me. Push up, squat thrust, option. Knees down, push up. Knees up, squat thrust, up to you. Good, rest there. Let's take it to a wide push up pulse. Bring your hands wider than your normal push-up. We're gonna go halfway and pulse. Down we go, 90 degrees at the elbow. Pulse it here. Open up that chest, let's build up a body strength. Well done, turn it around into your tricep dips. So we have five new exercises here, same format as the legs. Fingers forward, open up the chest, bum off the ground, bum off the ground, and bend the elbows for tricep dips. And dress there, well done. Turn it back around to our push-up. We're gonna add in a row to work the back. So after every push-up, we do two rows with me. Let's go, push-up, row, arm down. Row, 
repeat. Well done, exercise five out of five. Come down on the ground to a Superman. Let's, let's work the back of the body. Arms out, legs out, and we lift. Squeeze, release. Lift the upper body. Look forwards or slightly down, but don't look up. Shoulders back, elbows back. Glutes squeezed on, lower back working too. Well done. Let's repeat those five exercises for three sets, starting with the atomic push-up. Let's go. Now you know what we have coming up. Focus on the intensity and the quality. Well done. Moving into the wide push-up pulse. Hands into a wide push-up. Here we go. Get down and hold it and pulse it. Squeeze the shoulder blades together. Long spine, upper body working. You can drop the knees if you need to. And rest there, well done. Turn it around into your tricep dips. Open up the chest, hips up. Here we go, bend, touch the floor, push. Squeeze the triceps at the back of the arm. Push. Well done, turn it around into the push-up and row. One push-up and two rows, one each side. Here we go, nice and strong, down. And as the elbow drives up, squeeze your back muscles. Well done, take it down to the ground, into your Superman. Here we go. Lift, hold, and release. Well done. That is two sets complete. Let's do it one more time. You're doing awesome. Stay with me. This is hard sections to get through. Let's go. Atomic push-up. Final time. Well done, rest there. Upper body fatiguing, but this is good. Let's move into the wide push-up pulse. Hands out, get balanced, let's go. Make sure your shoulders are down your back, not hunched up into your ears. Keep going. Well done. Reaching fatigue in the upper body. Dips, turn around. Let's go. Push those arms. Well done, 
two exercises left of the upper body section, moving on into the push-up and row. Let's go. and rest there. Final exercise into the Superman before the core section. Let's go, 20 seconds. Well done, upper body complete. Let's turn around into the core section for a hollow hold. Lay on your back and let's go. Start here, extend the arms, extend the legs, belly in, back flat into the ground. Hollow hold. If it's tough, come back in. If you're ready, extend nice and long. Chest up. Rest there. We're gonna stay here for flutter kicks. Arms down, shoulders back, legs straight, and we're gonna get the legs up and down. Let's go. Don't touch the ground. Lower back flat into the ground. Nice and low off the floor. Working hip flexors and lower abs. Well done, rest there. Let's take it next into the sit-up. Either a full sit-up or a crunch if you struggle. Let's go, sit-up like this or crunch halfway, up to you. Building strength now in the core, in the six-pack muscles and that deep core strength. Well done, turn it around into a mountain climber. So, up nice and high here, core strong and knees coming up. Let's go. You could either do slow controlled ones or start jogging them. Knees up, engage those abs. and rest, well done. We're gonna stay here for a high side plank rotation. So, come up to a high plank with me. Let's go, from here, turn it around. One arm, reach up, core strong, place the hand down. Reach up, keep your shoulder above your hand, nice and strong upper body, pull your belly in and work the core. Two. One, and rest. Those five exercises, let's start again from the hollow hold. This time, just two sets, not three. So, final time in these five exercises. Hollow hold with me. Chest up, long arms and legs if you can. Breathe. and rest, get ready for the flutter kicks. Arms down, shoulders back, long legs and start kicking. You'll see it's a little bit easier to bring the chest just off the floor. That will help the lower back stay into the ground. To make it harder, you can lay back. Find your level and have a great workout. Every single set is up to you and rest there. The abs are burning. Let's stay here for sit-ups or crunches. Let's go. Squeeze the stomach, release and squeeze.
and rest there. Well done, turn it around to the mountain climber and then the side plank. Two, one, let's go. Mountain climber. You will find that obviously 20 seconds is really short and you find these sets are short, but how effective has it been for working the muscles in little circuits like this? You just wait for the cardio section coming up. And rest, well done. Get ready for the side plank. Here we go, high side plank, rotation. Well done. That is the core section complete. Up you come. Are you ready for the cardio section? We're gonna start with a squat jack. Squat here, jack it out. Squat, jack with me, let's go. So let's get five new exercises and three sets. And rest, get ready for high knees, running on the spot with knees up. Are you ready? Let's go. Knees up, high knees. If you struggle, then just jogging or running is fine. Use the arms, chest up, well done. 10 seconds rest before broad jump, run back. Bend, jump, land, run back. Are you ready? Let's go. Repeat. Land soft, good squat. Well done, rest there. Let's move it on into burpee. Standard burpee, if you wanna do a half burpee or a full burpee, it's up to you. Let's go, hands come down, jump it back, chest to floor or half burpee, jump or stand up. And rest. Exercise five, we're gonna take it to a side shuffle and twist. So from one side, shuffle, shuffle, twist, shuffle, shuffle, twist. Let's go. Up to you how many steps you take, whether it's just one, two, or three or four, if you have more space. But use the core with an explosive rotation. Even punch if you want. And rest, that is one set. Let's do it two more times from the squat jack. Let's go, squat jack. We're into round two out of three. So this cardio section is all about getting the heart rate up, working your fitness, cardio conditioning, and muscular endurance. Getting amazing calorie burn for fat loss, and working the cardiovascular system. Rest there. Let's take it to those high knees. Two, one, let's go. Knees up. Use the arms, stay up tall, core engaged. And rest there, well done. Let's take it into the broad jump, run back. Let's go, soft, jump, land, run back.
Building strong lower body. Well done, broad jump complete. Let's move it on into the burpee. Let's go. You have the option of a half burpee here without chest to floor anytime you need it. 10 seconds. Well done. Last exercise in the side shuffle and twist. Stay with me. We are making great progress through this workout. Almost done. Stay low in the legs, bend the knees. Twist in the torso. And rest there. That's two sets. Let's do it one more time. Stay with me in the squat jack. Here we go. Well done, rest there, breathe it in. Get ready for the high knees. Let's go, knees up, knees up. Well done, 20 seconds over. Moving on into the broad jump run back. Almost there, let's go. Keep up the intensity and efficiency and always focus on good quality technique. Well done, get ready for your burpee. Let's go. Oh, well done, we're working hard. Get ready for the side shuffle to finish off this cardio section. Woo. Let's go. Final 10 seconds. And rest there. We have a five exercise finisher. Come down into a push-up arm lift. Five exercises, they're a mix of functions. Let's go, push-up, arm lift, push-up, arm lift. We have a varied finisher. Let's push it to the end. Rest there, getting ready for a kick through on your hands, on your toes, open, kick. Come in, kick through. Let's go, with me, 20 seconds. It's one set of these five exercises. You only get one chance. Well done, exercise three. Let's get another burpee in there. Can you add a tuck? 
Land softly, see what you got, be safe, be strong. Here we go. Burp knee, tuck. Rest there. We are pushing it. Stay down into your mule kick. So, bend the knees this position, okay? We're gonna kick the heels up. Bend, kick, land, kick. Upper body work, core work, cardio. Let's build some strength in the shoulders. We're so close now. And rest there. What have you got? 20 seconds to sprint finish the end of the workout. I'm out of breath, I'm tired, but we're not gonna stop. Here we go. Sprint, fast toe taps. And complete Tabata. Oh my God, what a big finish. Breathe, recover, get your breath back, have a drink. Very important that you stay around for a few minutes to finish off this workout with some stretching. Stay with me here into a single leg hug. One knee comes up, extend the other. Shoulders back, breathe, smile, enjoy this sense of achievement. That was one hell of a workout. So well done for getting through it. Focus on slow, deep breaths. Bring your breathing rate and heart rate back to normal as fast as you can through relaxing the body. Keep your knee here, open up one arm and pull that knee across to wherever feels good to lengthen through the chest, shoulders, torso, and still into the hips and the glutes. Stay here and just relax into the floor. With every slow exhale, you just find a bit more space to increase flexibility. Come back into the middle, keep this knee up and go into that figure four glute stretch. With this leg on top of the other, reach through and lean back. Get a good deep stretch into the glutes and the hips. Okay, relax the legs down. Let's repeat the same on the other side. Pull that knee in, extend the other. Same three exercises with the other side. You should now be starting to feel a bit more relaxed. Heart rate coming down. Body should be warm, hot, sweating. And that's what we're doing here on this channel. Showing you ways to efficiently work out make the most of your time to get the best results possible. And open up the upper body and pull that knee across. If you're lucky, you might get a few back cracks like I do. 
but as a minimum, you feel a nice stretch across the torso. Okay, and spend the last 40 seconds in that glute stretch onto the other side. Reach through, lean back. Last stretch here. Don't leave this video yet, stay right to the end. And if you're enjoying the stretch, listening to me, then make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Click subscribe if you're new to my channel and comment underneath to let me know if you enjoyed this workout. I thoroughly did, and it's all better knowing that I'm doing it with you as well. And that takes us to the end. Thank you so much for watching this video. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.